Yeah, I was thinking about King Goobert. I was thinking about King Goobert, honestly. Because the invulnerability you gain from King Goobert is nice. Really nice. I'll buy it. We can go for a King Goobert. We can go for a King G. Alright, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we setting up here? I want you. Don't know how much of a good play that was, but I did it anyways. <laughs> TBH. I feel like uh, to make a uh, investment opportunity to work with mana orbs, you have to have a mana using weapon. You really need an amulet of energy or two. <clears throat> oh, if you have a mana using weapon, you need a amulet. Yeah. I could definitely see that. For sure, I could definitely see that. So we just buy every single amulet we see. <laughs> Get as many energy things, or even the alchemy, the alchemy, the alchemist uh, thing to make the uh, the mana potions proc more than one time is really good too, because that's extra mana. So those two is really the only jewels we would want. I mean, the red jewel is good too, because of the amplified and healing. That's just good. Uh, do I even get you? I don't need anything from Pyromancer to make this better, right? Not really. Yeah, not really. Damn it, was that a jewel box? Oh, uh, somebody. Somebody teach me how to play the game. Somebody please teach me how to play the game. Why did I just pass on a jewel box? Couldn't have gotten it now versus later. That's sad. Oh, there's a gooby. Sure. Can I fit you? Maybe potentially possible. All right, the best I can do. My banana can't really go anywhere. Oh well. But this is better than the other setup though. Mana potions are best, uh, for sure for this build. Mana in max HP is chef's kiss. Totem vertical? Uh, you, did you mean in the last setup? I'll change it back after this game. Hey Siri! <laughs> God damn it. Why did I do that? <laughs> My Siri turned on. That's funny. That's hilarious. Can I play both foods? I'll sway. How does one play both foods here? PMO, PMO, because I don't know how. I don't know how, I, yeah. I don't see it. I don't know, I don't see it. I feel like I'm gonna just do this though. That way at least both of the B-Nans could be in there. And we got a free Goobert. Ooh, we should win. He has no weapon. This is a fatigue build. One banana and garlic would go behind. Don't let this guy get a bag of stones, please. This 10 empowerment is insane. Oh my gosh. We're going for it again, right? I do want to try out Smelly Wall, but 
I think we just go for it again. Sorry, smelly wall. Next time. Next time, my friend. just gonna go for this fanny this last round that way I could do this and that and now we need a bag of stones and hopefully we can find another uh damn we really should have gotten that that box early would have been able to stack up some uh, some red jewels at least now we don't even have time to stack up red jewels before we find the crown. Unless we magically find it real fast. Hello. Alright, every amulet we see we buy. Early box with pig is extra powers. Agreed. Double spike shield sucks. <laughs> Every time we hit, we're just gonna do damage to ourselves. Health potion? W. Be good. Food? Okay. Decent. Decent. a lot of food. I wish I was you. Wow. Amulet of feasting, smelly wall. Where's your Excalibur? Where is it? Now nah, we lose this. <laughs> he's got he's got way too much defense. Bag of stones has nothing on this guy. I feel like they're going to nerf that. I honestly feel like they're just going to nerf it, bro. That's what it feels like right now. Can I please get something I want? Thank you. That is definitely something I want. Prefer a mana orb, you know, but uh, I guess beggars can't really be choosers right now. Oh. <laughs> Why, thank you. My good sir. I'll take another one for sure. I forgot I had this uh, amulet feasting. Ah, Death Scythe of Mushroom Farm is interesting. That was very close. Good game though. Hello, hello, hello. I don't know where to put everything. I don't even need this oil lamp, honest. Well, I'll keep it for now. I guess it's good to have on a broom that does no damage. <laughs> right? So we'll keep it for now. Uh, Wait, this is every three... No, it is faster. I was about to go off. About to get crazy in here. Should I just W key for cheese? Like a shit ton of cheese? Because this sells for two gold, right? Pretty sure. Hey, this can help me get um blueberries too. So that's good. Yeah, this does sell for two gold. Might as well buy this blueberry. I can get that back for one gold. Might as well buy that too. I think we lose this though. <laughs> well, he has no mana generation. Hold up. I mean, he's gonna be critting though. Jesus. Where did I get so much mana from? <laughs> I don't even know how we got that to proc. I should have moved you. It's fine. We still won by one health. Ow. Cheese, cheese. 
Cheese! Smile, mother. All the cheese. Uh, 1.1. This goober makes things so weird. <laughs> like it makes things so weird. That or I just need space. It's probably just... I forgot all about cheese goober. <laughs> uh, nah, we're gonna go for, yeah. We're just gonna go for the, yeah. No cheese goober. I forgot all about cheese goober. I forgot that was a thing. I don't like the way this looks. I'm gonna be honest. Cheese goob, you think we should go for a cheese goob over a crown goober? Oh, we lost. Oh yeah, we lost. Oh, maybe not. Our DPS is just too much. Your healing means nothing. Power to moon. Okay, we got lucky twice in a row. Round 10. We can keep this going. health potions though you know we can't be you know we can't forget about the health potions here certainly need some health potions i don't even think i need the stones and the totem anymore truthfully Take the wheel, because that was another box. That was another box of riches. I'm throwing. We might as well go for a fucking cheese goober at this point. Because apparently, I don't like buying that. I see it and it just, it, it just straight through my brain. It's just not there. It's the second time. Number two, numeral dos. For some weird reason, my brain just cannot recognize that there's a whole freaking item right there that I've been looking for this entire time. I think I'm just gonna get rid of I don't I don't need shell totem anymore, so we're just gonna we're just gonna get rid of it. I don't even need oil lamp, for real. I'll keep oil lamp though. Such a weird setup. So many cheese eye. Nah, this might be better. Nah, we don't have a lot of mana orbs like last time, though, to be fair. I was gonna say this might be better than last time, but the lacking in mana orbs. Thank you. Game for giving me three of these. You know how much I struggled. I really appreciate that. Honestly, bro, I don't even need more food. Like, at this point, we just need mana ores and we need the unhealing staff. We do not need more food. As I see another blueberry. I want it, though. We don't need it, bro. We don't. Like, one, two, three, four, five. Like, what are the chances we find four freaking healing potions? We do not need that blueberry. Move this under. You're right, that is way better.
All right, mana orbs. It's your time to come out and shine. I know you're mad. <laughs> I know you're mad. This entire damn time you haven't found an Excalibur. Oh, buddy, I know you're angry. Your eye would be upset. What round are we in? We're still missing the Excalibur at this point. Oh man, you would be doing so much better with the Excalibur too. Damn, that sucks. Tough. Kudos to that guy. Ammo of energy. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I dizzle. Sure, I'll play. First one on the block. Sure ski. I can make this better. Like the, you know, the placement. Placement of the toes, I can make this better. This entire build, this this entire placement can definitely be better. It could definitely be better. I'll rearrange after this round. Be like a whole new rearrange thing. This one looks like a high roll. That was a high roll. Don't know what the fuck I just died from, but I just died from it. I want to buy some stuff first. Buying every single jewel. That was a crown! Ah, someone get me. Someone, someone take it. Take the game from me. That was a whole crown. Y'all saw that? Y'all saw that crown there that we needed? I did. Womp womp. All right, how are we doing this? Uh, I don't need oil lamp because accuracy isn't a thing. Neither is damage. At least that means I can roll some more. Cool. All right, so let's see here. Uh, I guess we'll go toads. I kind of want to set these toads up differently, actually. I think I want to do them like this, or some iteration of this. And I want to utilize these amulets of energy inside of the toad star slots. I feel like that's just better. Cap to put in red jewels. Yes, but um, I mean, when we get the goober, it comes with two armor slots and they're both 50% more. We just got to get a crown. We'll see another crown. We're five rounds in like We'll see another crown. Maybe I'll just move these over by one and literally only worry about these amulets of energy being in here. Maybe that's the play. But they take up, they literally take up a, like a three by three. Take up so much space. The streamer moment. But I guess we could use you for a... Uh, Crown proc though. This is looking weird. Not going to lie. Well. I don't know. Should I use the Staff of Unhealing for a Goobert proc? Maybe set the toads up somewhere else? Something like this instead? Set the toes up over here, maybe? Maybe. can't do anything. How do you guys feel about this? I don't think it's bad. I think it's pretty solid. 
If we uh, math it, we can know right now. Amulet is only giving 20% of the use. C. I don't know. I feel like that's good, though. Well, it'll be good if this mana were procs. <laughs> or do you think we should just move it? I'm like... Or no. I think it looks solid. I don't know which one would be better. More mana orbs I think would be better, but... I don't know. I don't know. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> At least he doesn't have the stone for empowerment. That's good, right? At the very least. Or heat generation. He has, he has no heat generation. On a pyromancer is absurd. Damn. <laughs> ah. <laughs> he just died. He just. <laughs> I love it. Oh, look at the mana gained. Okay. Uh, mana. Mana gained was 70. The in No, that's used. Gained was that. We gained uh, 6.9 a second and used 5 a second. Toad gained four. And uh, I guess that's what you were looking at, Mace Banny. Is what uh, the Toad gained. Greetings from Brazil. It's really hot here, man. <laughs> 80 degrees Fahrenheit. I really appreciate your live streams. Thanks, bro. Hey, you need some air conditioning. Some fans, some of everything. Some of freaking everything. Yeah, the dude should have put a pumpkin inside the Excalibur for sure. For sure. Check out how many buffs we used. It was uh, that. Mana orb used 35, staff of healing used 35. Wanna look at the, the amulet? Uh, 18. Oh, I guess that's how much, okay, cool, that makes sense. So amulet of energy gained 18. So I guess it's not bad, right? More mana ores will make that go up as well. But the culture gains heat too. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Culture gained 15 heat. So it gained 18 mana and 15 heat. So it'd probably be better to do a combination of both. Because this is, I mean, this toad is touching the cauldron, which is good. So, I mean, we can make this toad touch the cauldron, too. I don't know. Because if this toad touches the cauldron, we would move this amulet here. But that's one less amulet for this toad. I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? I don't know. I don't think it's better now. <laughs> just because we got this new orb, orb, and orb. I feel like it's just not better now. That was not worth it. <laughs> oh, well. This is a little bit weird, though, because I want the mana orb to be here. Because I can't really... I mean, I guess I could go here, but I'd rather it be procking off the staff, right? I guess we would have to move you like this. Put you up here. That still works. Amulet of Energy is amazing to make multiple mana orbs proc for the investment. Agreed. It is better because it can proc and give more max XP. Agreed. We kind of got, we got mad lucky getting two. I'm hoping we can still get lucky, like even more luckier in these next four rounds. Okay. Um. <clears throat> oh. 
kind of want to utilize this pineapple. I mean, technically speaking, there's no reason for us to have the mana potions here. I mean, they make it, they just make it faster. That's it. Like, we could literally put these down here and put food here instead. And just do that. And that's just better. Versus potions being there. Since we have so much food. Keep the same setup. Might even put a food in that star slot. There. Alright, we're still looking for a crown. We need to find a crown next round because we need three combinations. One combination. No, we need two combinations. But yeah, we need to find a crown next round, regardless. Oh no. You get so much maximum health from that freaking thorn blooming empowerment. It's crazy. Damn, we got out maximum health it did. Out maximum health it did. Wow. We got out maximum health it did. All right, we need to find his crown, though. Unless we find some other things that are awesome. We're definitely double rolling for this crown. I just need to get the crown. I don't even want any jewels. Okay, I gotta get it. Gotta get it. Bro. 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 Where's the crown? We literally have to get it this round, too. Oh, this sucks. Because if we get it next round, we're not going to get it to combine with the, uh, the goober. Shit, should we just get a cheese goober? Emily, where a customer card is? And just move everything down by one? Jerry? I passed up a Jerry? There's no way. I always uh, ignored Carry Goober because the empowerment goes away after a while, but it's really good with Thorn Bloom, huh? Yeah, agreed. Another amulet on top of the first. Uh, Gabe's mad at me for skipping. It really is. Why do amulets generate mana with the frog? I just joined the live stream. So, the refund of 25 buffs used is what this thing gains so like if this or prox and it uses 35 buffs 35 or 25 percent of this 35 is gained by the amulet and whenever the star slots gain buffs the toads heal from that so that's why oh the enemy had jerry gotcha might as well point amulet at cheese i am so confused I'm gonna go for a cheese goober though, because we kind of fucked it. In that case, we might as well get some armor slots for these red jewels. And I'm gonna buy this too. And I might as well just combine. But yeah, what did you, uh. What did you mean, Narwhal? I'm confused. Aim of energy? Amulet where customer card is. So move the amulet of energy here, right? Make amulets into a giraffe. Oh, wait, do you mean like this? You mean like this? Frogs between amulets and cauldron. But don't you want one frog to touch two of these, though? But then no, frogs can only see one of each. Better if they see both. Yeah. I agree. Unless you mean like... 
for the frogs to, for both frogs to see both amulets in the cauldron at the same time. Is that possible? I don't think that's possible. Cauldron is... There's no way, gotcha. They both see one, and one's better than one see both. Well, they both see both. Both of the frogs see both of the amulets. It's just that one frog sees the cauldron and the other frog doesn't. The only alternative is like something like uh, like this. Where it's like one amulet, one cauldron, one amulet, one cauldron. It's one amulet, one cauldron, and one amulet, one cauldron, or two amulets, one cauldron, two amulets. Cauldron is doing as much as two amulets now. Well, yeah, but now it should be doing more. Because we have, I mean, if these mana orbs proc, then it'll be doing more, right? Because the more mana orbs that proc, the more buffs that are being refunded, which means the more buffs that the amulet of energies are going to gain versus just the cauldron, right? I think that's how it's working. Alright guys, predictions. Are we winning or losing this? What do you guys think? Winning or losing? L? You think we're losing? You think we're losing this? I don't know. Point the amulet at the cheese. It's pointed at the cheese. All the cheesies. Oh, you mean like rotate this? <laughs> okay. I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you after this game. I think... I think we might lose. Unless we one-shot them. We would literally have to one-shot the map fatigue start. But they're gonna gain so much maximum health. I mean, they only got, well, I don't know. Then they got spicy beanie ants. You think it's an L2? Double L's in chat? Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, oh, fuck, you're right. He's just gonna heal it back. We don't do enough damage. Ah, uh, Sag. Give me something better than this. Maybe I should just get this armor slot for real. Dreams! Thank you for the Twitch Prime sub, my friend. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, yeah, let me turn. There you go. Yeah, maybe we should get this, because it's seven gold. We need the armor slots for the amplified healing. And we don't need this amulet. I don't know where to put the armor, though. But I'll get it, but I don't know where to put it. Maybe here. Also, we need to figure out a spot for this mana orb. Unless we don't use Staff of Unhealing for an activator anymore. What do you guys think? We'll just move this down. Wait, maybe there's a world. Maybe there's a world, hold up. Maybe there's a world where this works.
Maybe. Maybe there's a world. Um. Uh, wait. 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 <laughs> wait. <laughs> Already looks cool. <laughs> My idea was this, I think. Is that kind of just works? Am I cooking? Am I cooking? Am I cooking? Possibly. Possibly not. <laughs> okay, possibly, possibly so. Hey. Okay, I think the cook has commenced. I think it has commenced. All right, check. Check. We just gotta get all these mana orbs of proc. I really wish we had more mana potions. That's the only thing I think that can make this build better is way more mana potions. And that's really about it. Alright. Less money if you combine. I'll just combine it just to get a benefit, like a higher benefit. It felt like I didn't get any buffs at the start of the game. That's why I paused. I was like, what the fuck? Nah, this guy is destroying us, though. There goes our buffs. There we go. Give me that maximum health. I need a little bit more. Oh, wow, 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 wow. I don't like dragons anymore. <laughs> Oh, my homies hate dragons. Hold up now. Should I do that? Where's the crown? Hiding somewhere. Like a pussy. <laughs> it's avoiding us. Literally avoiding us, bro. I feel like this wouldn't be a bad spot, honestly. I just don't know where to move this potion out. I guess I could literally just do this. It'll make the cauldron slightly slower. I'll do it. Should I... I look for a crown? Like... Should I buy this? Potato, potato, any mini minor. Don't know. All right, let's look for a crown. 
I needed that five years ago. I don't think we're gonna find a crown. No crown. I don't even know where to put this potion. I really know where I can put it for real. No crown. Wop wop. I guess it's sold out. <laughs> I guess so. This went a lot better than last time, though. To be fair. We just need more mana orbs to proc. Getting this many mana orbs to proc is kind of hard. For some weird reason. And we we have double ammo of energies on top of that. We're refunding 50%. Maybe just more strong mana potions. That's it. Literally. Like, get four of those guys and you're, you're cooking. Wow. Double Doom Cat, we lost. Oh my god, why do we keep going against these builds? Not only does each proc remove 10% of our healing, reduce the opponent's healing by 10%, not only that, he has two of them. Not only does he have two, he has a cap of discomfort. He might even be proccing the serpent staff. Two crowns. Mana mastery. We definitely lost. You just made some blueberry muffins? That sounds extravagant. Sheesh, yeah. We lost. Our healing is zero. <laughs> Literally zero healing. You versus the guy she told you not to worry about, right? Exactly, bro. Exactly. Nullifying. Look how many buffs we just nullified. My golly. I mean, look at look at the damage. Zero 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 zero. This is the unhealing build killer. Like there, this this alone is just it's the unhealing build killer, bro. Spikes, spikes, <laughs> sixty three damage from spikes. Wow. <laughs> Bro. That's so fuck. It's so... You don't even need this, man. You don't need this. What's the point of having your... I guess nullifying my buffs. That's about it. Rip. Rip. <laughs>